Two years of LC knowledge in 60 seconds, sponsored by EA. Dead Zone, I have 5%, but it's different for every controller. You want it as low as possible without any stick drift. Set this after you set all of your other settings. Outer Threshold does two things. It makes your overall sensitivity feel faster or slower, and it also controls how fast or slow your extra turning pitch and yaw come to play. Response curve is simply how responsive your sensitivity is going to be. The lower, the more twitchy it's going to be. Zero will be linear. And the higher, the less twitchy it will be and the more control you'll have, with 10 being a classic. For optics things, this is what I personally use, making all my sights feel almost the same. For both hit fire and ADS, yaw is going to be side to side, pitch is going to be up and down. Turning extra yaw and pitch are simply the extra speed that's going to come into play when your stick is pushed to its maximum outer threshold. This plus this can never be more than 500. So doing this and doing this will have the exact same maximum speed. For ADS yaw and pitch, I run a 130-90, which is approximately a 3 to 4 ADS on classic. But as you can see, I run 0 on the next 4. This is because I prioritize movement with my hit fire and accuracy with my ADS. You won't have that extra boost to make up for bad crosshair placement. If there's a saying you want me to go more in depth on, make sure you comment down 